่ฟ้าก็ปรากฏว่าพี่ฟ้าสนใจข่าวที่เกี่ยวข้องกับนวัตกรรมหรือ innovation นะคะในที่นี้ก็คือ backpack ยี่ห้อของ Jan Sport นั่นเองนะคะดูสิคะว่าเอ๊มันจะมีอะไรที่ใหม่เกี่ยวกับ Jan Sport แล้วจะมีวิธีการอ่านข่าวอย่างไรนะคะเดี๋ยวฟ้าจะพาเราไปชมค่ะแต่ก่อนที่จะไปชมคลิปเต็มนะคะให้เตรียมปากกาหรือว่าดินสอไว้ก็ได้นะคะเอาไว้โจทย์คำสาบค่ะ10คําที่จะไฮไลท์ไว้นะคะดูสิคะว่าเรารู้จักคําไหนแล้วหรือว่ายังไม่รู้จักคําไหนค่ะไปชมกันเลยค่ะ hmm. What's happening in the news today? How about technology? Any interesting news articles? How about startups? Jan Sports High Tech Backpack shares your social media. Wow, this is a new innovation. Very interesting. Let's read for more information. Okay, the headline says. Jan Sports High Tech Backpack shares your social media by Matt McFarlane. So, he's the author who wrote this article. Jan Sport is experimenting with a high tech backpack to give teens another way to express themselves. Hmm, this is a nice leading sentence. The company has developed 300 backpacks with programmable fabric, allowing users to share a song, music video, a Facebook page, or internet link with anyone nearby. The prototype acts as a backpack patch for kids of the digital age, rather than sewing one on to advertise a favorite band. It could direct others to a YouTube clips of an artist. Oh, so this is what the backpack prototype looks like. When the person opens the iOS app, Apple looks and points a smartphone camera at the backpack. A piece of content uniquely associated with it will launch. Think and visions. One day, the backpack could send you an email when it's lost. A misplaced backpack could be scanned via the app to identify and contact the owner. The technology is similar to a QR code, but blends into the fabric design. When each backpack is made, the threads are arranged in a unique pattern. That distinct style of stitching allows each backpack to be identified by the smartphone app. Moon said, "He is often approached by vendors wanting to add complex gimmicks to backpacks, but he was drawn to this technology because of its simplicity. The backpack has no wires or batteries yet." Still connects with the digital world. I think those paragraphs are quite informative. The writer gave clear details about the backpack's functions. There are no guarantees Jansport will sell these backpacks, but Moon said the earliest the technology could be incorporated into Jansport backpacks. Is in 18 months. The company which gave away the 300 backpacks at an MIT event on Monday hasn't considered potential pricing. What? No guarantees. In my opinion, I don't think the price will be that expensive, since their selling target will be teenagers. There's growing interest in how technologies can be incorporated into clothing. 
Google generated Bus last year with its project Jaquad technology, which weaves a touchpad into the sleeve of a Levi jacket. Other companies, including Samsung, have also experimented with smart fabrics. Fink and Moon have also discussed more ways to bring personalization to backpacks, such as the ability for them to change colors each day. Wow, this is a good summary of the news. A combination between technologies and clothing. Oh, wow, I can share this news article to many social media platforms like Facebook or Twitter. Hmm, I agree with this. There's growing interest in how technologies can be incorporated into clothing. But I disagree with there being more ways to bring personalization to backpacks, such as the ability for them to change colors each day. From my point of view, I think it's wasteful. I don't think changing colors is a good function, but maybe teenagers like it that way. We'll see when they are out in the market. Oh. Hmm. I can't wait to see those high-tech backpacks. <laughs>